Welcome back to Supercar Street Racing. Brad here, and you're inside of the Supercar Street Racing garage. And today, we're working again with Shine Armor, and this is their interior cleaner. And we're going to be taking a look at that today on the station. Stay with us. You're back on Supercar Street Racing, and we are so happy to be working again with the company Shine Armor. And they have provided us with this interior all-purpose cleaner. So what we're gonna be doing today is taking a look at this and unboxing it and seeing exactly what you have to do to apply this to your interior. Now we do have Dukes of Duval seat right here off of his club car precedent. And we're gonna be trying to clean that up a little bit for him and then we'll take it back to his house and install it directly onto his golf cart. So stay with us, that's coming up next. Right here in front of the 2014 club car precedent and the 2023 Tesla Model S Plaid. We're going to be working with Shine Armor again, and I'm super excited to work with them. They've been awesome, and they have sent me several products. And today we're going to be taking a look at this interior all-purpose cleaner, and we're going to be using it right here and right now on the Dukes of Duval club car precedent seat. And you notice right off the bat that Shine Armor does enclose this in a plastic bag for shipping because these kind of products have a tendency to leak. It's not just Shine Armor. Most places that do shipping of these kinds of liquids will go ahead and put it in a plastic bag. So let's go ahead and open that up now. We got our SCSR scissors, which are not working very well, but hey, they're doing the job though. So inside of that, you see Shine Armor does give you a pump spray to go on top of your bottle. And then you have this nice all-purpose interior cleaner and right on the front it says that it's non-greasy and it does have a matte finish so it's not going to look shiny and it's anti-static and sun blocking and it's safe to use on leather vinyl and plastics and what we do have right here and right now is a vinyl seat this is not leather and so we're going to go ahead and check out the directions on this and then go ahead and get this seat all cleaned up today so right in front of us, you do see the directions here for the Shine Armor Interior All-Purpose Cleaner. And that does indicate that you need to spray the interior cleaner directly onto a clean, folded microfiber towel. And we do have these purple microfibers here that were provided so graciously to us from the company Shine Armor. So that's the first step. Then the second step is you gently wipe the surface with the first cloth quickly switch to the other cloth folded microfiber towel and then you so I think the directions are a little bit off here it says quickly switch to another folded microfiber towel and residue uh, doesn't sound right for best results reapply every three to four weeks or for maintenance so step three has a little bit of a um, issue there it's missing some instructions so i will let the company know but those are the steps to using shine armor now the first thing you're going to want to do with your all-purpose shine armor cleaner is go ahead and put the pump spray on so give this thing a turn right there it is sealed so you will want to go ahead and remove that little foil top off of there go ahead and spray Insert your spray nozzle right into the top of the all-purpose cleaner. Now your Shine Armor all-purpose cleaner is all set to go. Now that we have our Shine Armor ready to go with the pump spray on top, what we need to do now is follow the directions and it says spray it directly onto a microfiber towel. And this does have a little lock on the side that you have to push to make it work. So it's this little push button right here that you have to push through and it does lock it. And there we go. So it is coming out. So we have a generous amount on our towel there. Let's remove our other towels there so we can get going. And then after this, you just gently wipe the surface with the first cloth and then you quickly switch to another cloth. And this is where the instructions are wrong. And we're gonna go ahead and wipe that down really good. And then quickly we switch over to a clean one and take off the residue. And that is the first step to that. 
And then it says for best results, reapply every three to four weeks. So we're not quite done yet. We're gonna go ahead and do the next section here. does have some pretty tough stains in there that may be part of the vinyl at this point and unable to be cleaned. So we're just doing our best with what we have to work with here, but we get our dry cloth and go ahead and buff that out. And once again, let's fold this towel over and go ahead and get this last section here. I'm gonna go ahead and go over the whole thing again. And then go ahead with our dry cloth, flip that over and wipe off all of the cleaner there. And I'm slowly spilling it all over the floor because the top came off. All right, so a little bit of extra spilled out. But that is basically how you use the Shine Armor Interior Cleaner. All right, we're gonna go one step further here. These seats are incredibly stained, so we're gonna try something else. We got a magic eraser here. And let's tighten this up because it already spilled. This time we're gonna put it on the magic eraser. See if we can get any better results because this is a pretty stained seat. And even the magic eraser can't get off what the seed has had for years. Actually, it is getting quite a bit of it off now that I see it. So this is going to take some work. You can see right here, this stuff does work. The magic eraser helps with the cleaner as well. The stuff does work. The magic eraser is assisting it and the dirt is coming out. The seat is in really poor condition anyway, so anything this stuff can do, it's doing. Yeah, you can see this stuff is getting off. It just really can't get everything because the, the vinyl is stained, like internally. So Dukes of Duval probably needs a new seat, but before that, he can use this one and it can be nice and clean for him thanks to the Shine Armor Interior All-Purpose Cleaner. I did compare the Shine Armor here to the VLR and I honestly think that the Shine Armor is doing a better job on this than the VLR does. So that's why I got the VLR out side by side here with the Shine Armor. I gave that a shot and it did not do as well at getting the grime off with the Magic Eraser. So guys, that's the extent of what we can do here with this seat because it is in pretty poor shape. I um, think Dukes of Duval is gonna get new seats anyway, but I wanted to demonstrate the product here with you guys. And now let's throw it into Supercar Street Racing Studio with Brad. Welcome back to Supercar Street Racing and the 4K Production Studio. You're with Brad and today we're taking a look at the Shine Armor line of products for your vehicle. And you can see right here on the screen, they're having a 23% off sale. Right now you can use your code FALL23, but also make sure that you click on the link in the description so that I get some credit for that because I do have an affiliate link with Shine Armor. So taking a look right here on their website, you can see the front page if we go to their interior products here. You can see right here, this is the car upholstery and interior cleaner that we just showed you outside in the Supercar Street Racing Garage. Now there is gonna be a point when that stuff is not going to be able to take off years and years of stained stuff going into the vinyl or leather. So that's the best we could do with it. It did make an improvement, and especially when we added the Magic Eraser along with the cleaner, it made such a huge improvement. Um, but nothing's gonna get out those deep stains in that vinyl if it's already part of the actual fabric. And you can see right here, if we click on this, 
does have all five star reviews on here. It is $15.95, but like it says on the front page, they are having a sale right now. So make sure that you grab that. And taking a look at some of the pictures here, you can see them putting it right there on the dash. It's all purpose. You can use it on pretty much everything inside of the car. Right there, you see it sitting on the dash. And then that's them using their uh, chamois cloth towels there that they sent me as well, their little cleaning towels. And yeah, so if we take a look down here, it just shows you a little bit more about the product. And it says it helps your interior shine brighter than ever before. And it says it's a secret weapon against stains, odors, and dull surfaces. And then down here it shows you that it's safe and non-toxic, which is awesome. It has deep cleaning power and gives you professional grade results. And you can see right here, right now, the reviews all say five stars. And if you read through some of these reviews, they're very good. I've been very happy with Shine Armor products and I have worked with them now for a few months. And this is the third product I've actually taken a look at for them and I hope to be able to work with them some more in the future. Um, really cool company and make just the products that I need for my 2023 Tesla Model S Plaid. Guys, please be sure to hit the like and subscribe button here and buy anything you need off Amazon through any of my Amazon affiliate links. I get credit even if it's not the actual product. Click any of my links and buy anything on Amazon. You'll help the channel out greatly. We do need it. We lose money on the channel. We make zero money on this channel. Um, it's a loss for us. So it helps us so much when you can click through our links and you like and subscribe. And we'll see you next time in the 4K Production Studio, guys. I'm um, peace out.